Afro Nation is now speaking aloud right now. David O performed on Borderly at Afro Nation despite of the dragon that has been coming in from Anita who claims that she is pregnant for David o. She's been making a lot of statements on social media. David o decided to say, man, <laughs> let me use this Afro Nation to give her some energy. I love the energy of David o at a time like this. Let's take a peep at David o's performances at the Afro Nation. It's what's my lady! They want to see me fall, but I ain't stop it, I do they follow. I don't make some noise for yourself. Since she started this, David O has been on board at promote his US tour, and a lot of people are signing up for the US tour right now. I think I have to like give it up for David O's energy on guard. That is what is supposed to be. This is going to infuriate this lady more. The French lady who claims that David O also impregnated her is asking Anita to shut up that she is talking too much. Let's take a glimpse also at this. Then and calm, and he appears you hurt because it's so bad for you. It's so bad when you pregnant to be in this type of mood and i know what i'm talking about like you know hormones and all that stuff play a lot on your mood but please girl think about it twice before putting it on social media that's something that we shouldn't share you, you understand what i mean like we all have stuff we all have things to say but that's something that you shouldn't talk about publicly you should not talk about that it's going too far it's too private and you will get a lot of bad things for that because you can't you can't talk about private life of somebody that much and and be happy 
like it's your private life too but it's his and it's hers and you need to respect that they're humans they're not like just a robot who uh in your life that humans human feeling they are like you and me and they can get hurt too please just think about that see i really not, i am really not judging you i don't want to be mean either i just hope that god gives you forgiving hurt and that he will give you a cheer i understand that you can be upset that it's one thing to drag out a man who got you pregnant and had bad behavior with you i understand that i really understand it like i'm on the same um level but it's really mean to talk about a woman who doesn't do it to you she doesn't even know you like she don't care about you you see and to talk about her like that and to talk about their relationship that you don't even know about man you don't need that it's just bad beauty. and it's so mean like you don't even know what she's going to do what she's ha handling now don't don't do that much you don't need that we understand that you got man you're not the only one we know but chill but i understand that you want to talk about your pregnancy like people will see it and they will know that you are pregnant and they will know who got you pregnant that you can't you can't hide that forever you can talk about that that it's fair it's yours it's your body it's your bump it's your child too it's fair but all the other stuff you are talking about that that's really i look at your story and the word that you're using so mean like it's useless you don't need that so mean girl like you will regret it. Just look at what you said. You talk about employment women and other stuff. And then you're dragging her out, calling how they talk about her in the bath. Do you really think she wants to hear that? She need that? Man, stop. Stop. That's too much. That, that's awful. Like, it's me. I really think that now we don't need to talk about all that anymore. We don't need to, to, to get through all that anymore. Like, it's going too far. In all of this, what are your own takes? I need you to keep that in the comment section so that we can talk about it further because a lot of people are really giving their two cents on this. Consider subscribing by hitting the subscribe button below the bell notification icon to always get notifications each time we upload our videos. I love you guys. Keep supporting Afro B blog. Keep supporting Free West Deep. Allegedly messed up somebody's marriage that was already messed up, but that's none of my business. But anyhow, like nobody's here is trying to do that. I don't want to take nobody's place because there can only be one me. There's only one Nina Dealey, one Anita Brown. I don't want to be nobody else. I don't want nobody's spot. I'm Gucci. Like I literally focus on my businesses. I focus on working hard and doing me. Like this happened. Like it happens. Like and like and what? I'm still favored. I'm still blessed. God still loves me. Like. And that's what I want to set the record straight because I'm not going to get on Instagram and everybody talking about things they don't know. And because I've been being quiet and I've been being peaceful, it's only getting worse. And I'm I'm trying to save face for other people, but then it's defaming my name and I'm not having that. So this is why I'm here. I don't need clout, my loves. Y'all can't give me clout.